Hello. Hi. Welcome into the vintage and sophisticated jewelry store. I am the owner here, proud owner. I have spent countless dollars on the displays that you'll be seeing as you wander the store. What is it that brings you in specifically? Okay, so a little bit of everything it sounds like. Good, well come step over here. How about we first take a look at rings? Do you like rings? Yeah, okay. Well, let me show you some good ones. Let's first take a look at this one. When I found this one, I said, oh, this one is going to sell like crazy. Count my word, it will only be in the store for a few short days. And you are one of the first to see it. So here we go, are you ready? It's this right here. Wow, that is just beautiful. What's wrong? It's not enough bling for you. What do you mean? Has a lovely little gem right there in the middle. Custom made. You don't like that? How does it look cheap? I don't see cheap at all. I see very expensive chef's kiss luxury. Wow. Okay. Well, no worries. Since this one just isn't for you, I will look for something that might better suit your style. Um, something with more bling? You need more, more, more bling? Okay, extravagant bling or average bling. I have just the thing. Now, if you wear this ring, oh, this one is a royal ring, okay? This has been passed down in the secret royal family for quite some time, and you are not going to believe the way these diamonds shine. Oh, take a look at that. Wow. What do you mean it looks plasticky? This is metal and diamond. Shit, it is. Do you know how much I paid to get this ring here in this location? How dare you? I can't believe that you think it looks cheap. That is a stunning ring. Not everyone can pull this ring off. Maybe you just can't pull it off and that's why you think it looks cheap. When in no way, shape, or form was this ring cheap, or is it cheap, let me tell you. But, it's probably just simply not for you. So why don't we instead look at this ring. Now, this one has been found on an ancient pirate ship. This was back in the 1800s. This stone that was inside the ring was so dirty, you couldn't even tell what it was until they cleaned it. And this is what they found. Oh my gosh. Wow. 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 Do you see that? Do you see it? That is a beautiful stone, expensive stone, found on a pirate ship years ago stone. What do you think of it? You want me to tap on it? No, it doesn't sound like the other one. This one is a much higher quality even. Well, if you're not in love with it, just seeing it as is, I might be able to persuade you into liking it once I show you the matching set 
there is a necklace that goes with it as well so you could have the necklace and the ring let me show you now you'll also be the first client to get to see my new necklace display it holds earrings necklace ring earrings necklace ring earrings necklace ring and you're gonna see that today so let's try it on there should be a pair of earrings somewhere but I'm not sure where at the moment I'll have to look there might be a matching pair of earrings oh my gosh would you look at that <gasps> And you see this little piece right here, that white piece? Yeah, that's actually white gold. In case you're wondering, it's not plastic. Look at this set, though. This will look absolutely stunning on you. I can't get past it. Let me hold it up to your skin tone. Oh, I think you need this. This is the one. I'm telling you, this has got to be the one. No. Okay, no worries. We have many more to look through. I'm sure you'll find something. Let me go to the back and get a few more things. Okay, I'm back. I found something that I can guarantee you've never seen before. And the reason I know you've never seen it is because it was just recently excavated from its resting place. Now, I don't believe in taking up graves, but couldn't pass up this offer. Wait till you see this beauty. Mm, it doesn't want to sit very well on the necklace holder, so we'll just have to hold it on there. Come on, get on there. Okay, I'm just gonna hold it for you to see. Look at that. Can you see how beautiful that amethyst is right there? Yes, I do believe this was very, very old. I'm not 100% who it belonged to, but now it is in our possession. And let me tell you, we also have Just pardon me. Alright. We also have the matching earrings. What? Look at that. I know that this must be the set you're looking for. There's no way you could pass this up. This is just stunning. Look at those. Look at these can't pass these up. What are you thinking? <laughs> well, see, you keep mentioning that it looks cheap to you. Can you explain to me what you're... What? What does that even mean? Alright. Well, I can't say that I understand where you're coming from because I don't. But... What I can do is show you a few more things. Since you don't like my first or second or third pick, let me go ahead and show you this. Here I have one of those bracelet holders. It's brand new, just got it today. Let me show you these. These are some stunning bangle bracelets, as they say. Bangle and dangly. But look at that. These are 100% white gold. And they are stunning. There's no way you could think these aren't pretty. Beautiful. They are sparkly. No, they don't have any diamonds or bling, but the metal 
hear that metal? The metal themselves are super, super shiny, blingy. You can see it. You stand out. But let me show you a few more bracelets that are in this pouch. Pouch. Wow. There's your sparkle. Do you see that? There's a holographic glitter bead. Super pretty. So we have that. We have the metal ones we looked at. Wow, a pink opal. Very pretty and rare. These pink little gemstones. These were actually dug up from lava. So where the lava eroded the rocks, that's where this rock and gem and bead came from. I know it's hard to believe, but it's true. Same thing with this one here. It's just a bit of a different shape and style. And then let's take a look at these last two. We have this beautiful same rock, pink heart shape, and some beautiful green, blue, pink, yellow, multicolor. I'm not sure where those came from, but all I know is they were expensive, so they must be something important. Now, do you like any of these? I can see you wearing this really pretty sparkly one here. Pink, blue, clear, green, holographic sparkle. Any of the pink would look great on you too. I just don't think you should do this one because... Mm, it's not as nice as the rest, and it's the cheapest retail. You want something more expensive, right? More high-end. So that's these ones here. Or the white gold. Sparkle, white gold, or pink lava rock. Which one is it gonna be? You still don't like any of these? Well, I don't understand. Let me try to show you this beautiful one again. You just need to see it up close. There's no way you could not think this is absolutely beautiful. We have so much shimmer, glitter, and pizzazz, and it is just stunning. It would look so pretty on. Look how high-end. These beads look like glass. They are even more expensive than glass. You must want it. No? Uh, Alright, well, let me tell you this. I have one more idea. I have a pouch. A small pouch that has some very, very luxurious jewelry in it. Let me show you. And if you decide to buy this, you get everything inside, so it's just one inclusive price. Isn't this just a very nice little pouch? It's multi-dimensional, iridescent glitter. You have the beautiful silver straps and a nice velcro clip close. But I know you're just wanting to see what's inside. So let's take a look. You have a nice big opening in here to fit lots of jewelry. So let's reach in and see the first thing we find. Oh, wow. Look at these earrings. <laughs> so stunning, right? Look at how pretty and colorful, like mermaid. It's okay if you don't have your ears pierced. These actually just clip on. They are some luxury clip on earrings. Well, maybe you just don't like the first item. Let's see what else we have in here. Oh, wow. Look at these earrings. A beautiful peachy pink with some hearts. Very pretty and glittery. See, I'll hold it up to my ear so you can get the idea. 
What do you think? Yes, these are very high end. Well, how about this? We have the matching heart necklace. Perfect time to pull this stand back out. We have the heart necklace and let's see if we can clip this on. All right, there's the necklace and one of the earrings so you can get the whole picture. Now that is just beautiful and if you don't like that color, you can of course do the other one with the matching necklace which is this peachy pink. Let me set this down. Um, did you said how much for this pouch? Well, it is one, two pairs of very royal luxury earrings and two beautiful necklaces. So for this pouch and everything included, it's going to be about $900. Why would you think that is too much? Do you know how much I paid for these? I'm barely getting any profit in return for that sale. Well, if you'd like, the most fancy thing that I can show you since you're saying my stuff is junk or plastic-like, I have some tiaras that happen to be worn by Queen Elizabeth. Would you like to see those? Well, I will get them for you. Please excuse my rudeness, but I'm just not used to anyone telling me that my jewelry that I spend a lot of time and money searching for is not good. So I'll be back with those tiaras. Okay, so since it looks like this will be our last resort to come to an understanding of a product that you might want to buy from me, I got a very pretty and glamorous tiara Queen Elizabeth wore, and here it is. Isn't that just lovely? Look at how it sparkles and shimmers in the light. She only wore this about five times, but this anybody would be so honored to wear, I'm sure. Not enough bling? Well, one more thing I have to show you then. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave the store because that would be considered loitering if you're just hanging around and you're not gonna buy anything. This is the last and final item I will be showing you. And how pretty is that? Look at it. Look at the glitz and glam. Uh, you think this is arcade jewelry? Arcade jewelry? Really? Alright, you have... Uh, I'm so mad, but I'm going to just try to hold it together and I'm going to nicely ask you to please turn around and exit my store. You are ridiculous. You've insulted my beautiful money well spent jewelry. Um, time and time again, you don't like any of the products. You're wasting my time. So please kindly just get out. And this is not arcade jewelry. Shut the door behind you. Don't let it hit you on the way out though.